elbow ossification centers. Interpretation of elbow radiographs can be complicated. There's a lot of ossification centers that can be confusing. Elbow trauma and injuries are common, and the ossification centers can look like bony fragments, and bony fragments can look like ossification centers. Knowing the time of development of the normal ossification centers can be important. Although this timing may be variable, you can guess the approximate time of appearance of the ossification center by using the mnemonic cry toe. This cry toe will make you remember the order of appearance of the different elbow ossification centers. C-R-I-T-O-E The time of appearance is reliable, although variable, especially in girls, where ossification center can occur earlier than boys, sometimes by two years. A rough timing estimate that's easy, that is simple, will be helpful. So we take the cry toe and match it with 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, 11. The cry toe is capitellum, radial head, internal or medial epicondyle, trochlea, olecranon, external or lateral epicondyle. This is more helpful in looking for the medial epicondyle, for example, after an elbow dislocation that's evolved and maybe trapped in the joint and you couldn't find it in its normal location because you don't remember if it's even developed. But if you find the trochlear ossification center and you do not find the medial epicondyle ossification center in its normal location, then look inside the joint, especially if you know the age of the patient and you know that the internal or the medial epicondyle should be developed by then. So you ask yourself a question, I can't see the medial epicondyle in its normal location, but the trochlear ossification center is there. The internal epicondyle should be seen because it developed before the trochlear ossification center. The internal developed at 5, the trochlear developed at 7. One of the most important things is to know the age of the patient. So if the age is 5, these are the ossification center that are expected to be seen. If the age is 11, I expect to see this ossification center. If the age is 3, I expect this ossification center to be seen on the x-ray. Look for the normal position of the ossification center. Finding what appears to be a fracture or an ossification center in the area of the olecranon or the lateral epicondyle in a young child should not be interpreted as an ossification center, which should be developed later. So I don't expect these bony fragments to be ossification centers at that age. I will seriously look for a fracture. Cry toe, one, three, five, seven, nine, eleven. Thank you very much. I hope that was helpful.